idea. Spot and stalk. Oh god. Spot and stalk. Fucking boar. Amazing, my guy. Scott. It's a great time. That's what you call up close and personal. That was that was about 40 yards with a 308. Um great. We've been stocking these hogs all the way down this road, playing the wind. <clears throat> it's my first hog. Give me a minute, I gotta get calmed down a little bit, but it was great. I had Josh behind the camera. Ronnie Miller at the buck and boar. My guide Scott. Unbelievable. Stay with us guys. We'll get this hog. Check it out. Yep, good deal. Good shoot. Well guys, you seen how close that was. This place is amazing. And uh, I was gonna shoot one with a bow. I chose not to because my bow is not hitting as hard as Josh's was. Have you seen Josh's shot yesterday? Josh didn't get a pass through. Josh got half arrow penetration on a sow, not a boar. You guys can't bring your hunting equipment. You guys got to get heavy arrow setups. 70 pound bows. Josh's bow shooting probably 90 in kinetic energy. It ain't gonna happen today. We went out on something different just because I wanted it to be ethical. And uh, it all came together. Yep. Scott put us on them, and it's just uh, it's a great hunt. You guys got to check them out, Buck and Boar. Yep. Good deal. Good shoot. Appreciate it. Nice set. Well, folks, thanks for joining us this week on Buck Obsession. I hope you enjoyed this hog hunt with Brad and Josh at Buck and Boar, South Carolina. Definitely book your hunt with them. Give them a call. Check the website out. Uh, they have awesome hogs in there you can select from. Get that bacon for the freezer. We'll see you next week here on Buck Obsession. Buck Obsession.